Hi, this is Captain Al Lorenzetti. I've had a lot of questions about the clip rig that I invented and that I use for striped bass fishing with live bait. Uh, a lot of people purchase them from me, but when they get them, I get emails about, oh, well, how do you actually attach it and so forth. About 15 years ago, I started working on an idea that a way I could use a single hook and still fish a live bait and get a high percentage of hookups. Uh, I wanted to get away from using treble hooks because once a treble hook gets down past the narrow part of the throat and a striped bass, basically the fish is done. So with this clip rig, since it's a single hook, even if it gets down into the throat, it can be removed easily and the fish has a great chance for survival. So that was the main idea about it. Anyway, uh, I use a dual lock snap and I attach it to a hook with zip ties and uh, basically it's inserted into the nose of the fish. So I was going to give a little demonstration here. I'll take a live bunker and I'll show you just how to attach the rig into the bait so it'll work perfectly. Okay, we take the old happy little bunker out of the pen, or actually out of the well. Take my clip rig, I open up the dual lock, I use the hook, go into the mouth of the bunker, all the way, the whole gap of the hook, pull it out the top of the head, through all that tough cartilage. I remove the hook. Now I turn the clip around, I go in through the top of the head, through the hole I've just made with the hook, and as you can see I pull the bottom of the dual lock out the mouth, and this and then I close the snap. So the bunker is on the clip. The hook is totally exposed with this hook in the nose just as it is and it gets as you drift and pull them through the water it's a perfect presentation of the bait. When the bass grabs it they grab the whole fish. They have no teeth and they have to turn it and swallow it head first. Boom, the hook is right there. Almost an instant hookup. Most will be right in the mouth. And even if it gets in the throat, single hook, you can get down there with a hook remover, even your hand and a big bass, pop the hook out, the bass is going to be fine. It works super.